Damn. Him. Damn. Damn. You just made himself. it so like she should just got a way of making you realize stuff that you already realize. That's sad. That means he's the leader of them dudes. Of them yeah. dudes and that's his mindset. Yeah. He's leading all these grown men. He's dumb enough to be on camera. That's mm -hmm. sad. That's sad and, and scary. Right there with him. Another suspect. Another suspect. Guess what? In, in in reality, in federal court, another snitch. Another snitch. Another snitch. <laughs> another snitch. Another snitch. They need to get out that shit. Facts. So what AR? What's what AR is facing? Like what's, what's I mean? No, he, I know he, he's he facing the forty five. No, he's sentenced. He said, "Oh, he got he got." 45. Yeah, that was the sentence yesterday. Yeah. 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 That's what. That's that's the books. He, he in there for forty five years. Do I think he deserves it? Mm -mm. I don't think nobody deserves that much time. I think he's dead ass stupid for playing into uh, uh, like a system that was designed for mm -hmm. this to do exactly this so they don't have to fucking move out their office. But um, I just don't think nobody deserves 45 years. Like, I want them people... I know he did some bad stuff. Don't y'all hate them people that be like murder somebody and then everybody like, free them, free them. Yeah. No, don't free them. Nigga, he's yeah, a killer. Yeah. But um, I feel like uh, okay, yeah, I hate to say it like this. Y'all ever seen like people that's good people to they people? Yeah. And if you fuck with them, then they bad people. Okay, yeah. But you watch them be bad people to other people. So a smart yeah. motherfucker be like, I'm gonna go this way, bitch. And I'm, you can go that way because I don't want what you got to yeah. do with me. And I think that should be like law of the land. Like, let yeah. him run his fucking business. Ain't nobody fucking mad at what he's <laughs> yeah. doing because I ain't no, over there. You got there. a point. You got a point. Because we had a conversation before about niggas that make it to the top. And we was like, I wonder if this nigga had to knock somebody off along the way. And we was like, he probably, yeah, yeah. we was talking about Master P. Because a lot of stuff go on in New Orleans. Yeah, right. Master P is a good dude. But with all the stuff he been through and where it came from, it's People a chance he had to knock somebody off along the way. Yeah. And I still think he's a good dude. I you feel know, what you're saying, bro. Tight shit. Now, who is that in the gutter? So, so, so what, what's, what's, he, what's his charges? Uh, he got Rico charges for drug dealing and murders. He's involved in some. He he sent some hits. They proved that he sent some hits. One of the dudes who did the hit testified. Let so. me tell you how you get them Ricos too. See, they gonna start with the theory of the Rico. That's mm -hmm. that's how they start. We want this to be a Rico case, but now we gotta prove it. The fucking co defendants. Tell you everything you need to know. Everything you need to know to get the hell up out of there. Because I got you right here. We know you be with this nigga. You own video while he said they can use that as evidence. Like, if, if you want me to take your word as credibility, yeah. let's go. We'll take it as credible in the court, bitch. You said yeah. that this is what you do. Not tell us you lying or some shit, you know? And then yeah. we'll go ask your friends. That made me lying. wonder if Skinny testified. He always rap about this dude, Skinny, that did hits. And it's an interview of him sitting there like, I mean, Skinny right here, like, like everything he rap about, he actually did it. So if he say he killed three niggas, he did it. Cause I see him do it. He said it just like that. I ain't trying to be are? funny. He did it. He did wow. that. Wow. He did that, bro. I promise. He wow, bro. Yeah, that's stupid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So wild that, that, my sorrow kind of went out the window because it's one thing we do an interview and like they say Vlad trip you up. That's what I was expecting Telling to see. On your cell type shit. But he was way out there, really telling. He I told one. Listen, he told one story where he talked about how he was going to kill everybody on the corner. It was six of us, right? And then one of my six. friends was out there on the corner and we shooting at him. I didn't know he was out there. Which friend? He like, listen, turn the camera around. Tell him, like, am I lying? Like, yeah, oh, bro. They're going to shoot with that. <laughs> like, literally, like, he did the absolute, like, he really wanted y'all to know that he really did the shit that these niggas shit. rap about. The thing about that is, that's the, I, I don't understand that, if that makes sense. Like, if you really, like, live in that life or... Have you been living that life? I was talking about that with the dude from ATL the other day. Um, K, K, uh, OG, KK. Okay, I heard of him. It's like you must have just got this to where you want it to be. You must have been a nickel and dime ass nigga all mm -hmm. your life type shit. And now that you really own them, them birds and shit, you, you want to talk about it. You want to go around the people that you always want to be around. Because why are you 40 something around offset type shit? Why does that intrigue you to be taking a picture with rappers, the rappers that's hot right now? Only you if you didn't hot get when it was your time. Exactly. I you. So I feel like niggas that do that, it's an attention seeking thing because if you really did that, man, there should be like, a confidence within you. First of all, right. you know, bitches go to jail for that shit. You Which might be kind of happy the fake news taking the light off you. No, seriously. On, yeah. on gang, I wouldn't want that shit on me. That's facts, Dad. That's silly, but you must want some type of attention. I don't know. That shit, duh, that, that, that's, that's an issue. Duh. That's a big issue out there. Duh. Duh. And that kind of comes into like the player like Meat Mill where you being so sick of Meat Mill. It's like that attention, bro. Mm. Social media just had that effect on motherfuckers, bro. Like, well, you just reach and reach and reach and reach. 
Like, That's come crazy. on, man. Man literally indicted himself for the views. That's crazy. Bro. Like, for the views. You just put a camera out, bro. You just pull a camera out. Like, ain't nobody even asked you to start recording, bitch. Ain't nobody even <laughs> around here trying to interview your ass. You talk about yourself. What the fuck kind of shit is this? 